Lego centric and I'm doing another Lego DC Universe Super Heroes review. You can see my Christmas tree in the background. So not a very holiday set, but um, anyway, this is the Superman set. Uh, it comes with Lex Luthor, Wonder Woman, and Superman, and Lex Luthor is in a it's called Superman vs. Power Armor Lex. So this is Power Armor, apparently. Um, and it has a kryptonite gun, because there's a little kryptonite piece that you put in it when you build it. Um, I'll show you the back of the box. Kind of cool. Wonder Woman's hanging on with her golden lasso. And Superman is flying up. And obviously Lex can go in and out of that. And the gun, the real only play feature on this, which I thought it would shoot or do something, but the only play feature is that the gun can come out and um, in the comic that comes inside it, which the box is sealed back up, but I'll show you the booklet. It claims that it comes with a comic book. I mean, I think that's being pretty loose with the term comic book. Oh, actually, the comic book's upstairs. But anyway... Regardless, uh, it just is like five panels of, you know, Superman grabs the gun and shoots Lex and destroys the power armor in it. So that's the play feature that the gun can come out and Superman could use it or whatever. Um, but anyway, let's take a look at the set. This is the set. And I did what they had in the back of the box. I have Wonder Woman hanging on here, but we'll take a look at all the minifigs. This set has excellent minifigs. For $19.99, I think uh, it's 207 pieces. Set 6862. And for, for 20 bucks, this is a steal. I think this is a great set, especially if you're looking for this. This is the only one of the new sets that has Superman, Wonder Woman, and Lux Luthor. So three exclusive minifigs. Um, we'll look at her first. And she obviously comes with Lasso of Truth, I think it's called, or Golden Lasso. You can correct me in the comments if I'm wrong. Um, Great torso, great printing on the legs, print, printing on the front, back printing, which those are supposed to be shoulder blades, I guess, but kind of looks creepy with her backwards head. Um, and she's got a smiling face and then the angry face, which I prefer. Um, and a nice uh, little headband there on, that's attached to the hair. So she is a great minifig, and if you're a Wonder Woman fan, or if you're just looking for a pretty good fig. Um, then we have Superman, also great. You can see his six-pack there. Um, and I don't know how this compares to the previous one, because, like I said, I've never seen the Superman before. A um, little bit of back printing, just the belt underneath the cape, but nothing, nothing great. And if you can see, I have the hair... Um, the hair with the little curl, and I get this off. He's got two faces, and they're almost identical. Let's see if I use my teeth. I can't. Oh, boy, I can't get the hair off. It's on there so tight. Um, but his he has a, a, a kind of like a blank stare, and then he has like an angry face too. Um, and he he another great great minifig in the set. And then finally, we'll take Lex Luthor out of his chair here in the power armor. And he's got a really cool suit on. Really flashy suit. Could be used at any set. Um, and he's got a one-sided face. The only way to determine the difference between Superman and Lex Luthor's faces is that they have a, uh, they have a slightly larger eyebrows. It was really hard at first. Like, you have to look at the eyebrows and you have to look at... Superman has a little pointy chin but they have the same markings on the side of the face and the same mouth, so it's, it is kind of confusing. But um, some back printing, if you can make that out. Uh, this webcam is terrible. But um, really cool. Another really cool minifig. I think these are all great. And then finally, the main, the main part of the set. Uh, I would say this is probably like your standard transformer size. Um, definitely a lot of playability. The hands open up. And you know you can grab. They could grab. Super. He can grab Superman in his clutches, for example, and um, and the back. It's got these two rocket kind of propulsion things here, and this tube that's feeding the kryptonite gun. Uh, it, it has a joints at the feet and at the 
the hip so it can walk um, if you're playing with it the feet and everything kind of rotates around pretty good actually it's got a lot of movability same thing on the arms um, you know can move it however you want it's like too much movement actually slippery counter um, but anyway and then the lastly really the only other thing to show and this is obviously where Lex goes in and that closes the gun from this side the only other thing really to show is that I don't know if you can see in there there's a little bit of a glare but there's a kryptonite crystal right in there and that looks really really cool in person it looks really good so um, that's cool and as the play feature I said the gun just the gun just pops right off and um, you know, if you want to do anything with it, like in in another set, or you wanted to have Superman holding it, or you're using it against Lex Luthor or something. So, really cool set. I think to absolutely worth it for twenty bucks. Um, pick this up if you can find it. Like I said, I don't think a lot of people do have this. I don't know if my Toys R Us put them out early or not, um, but. Uh, definitely recommended, especially for Superman fans. Uh, like I said before, I'm not a humongous Superman fan, but I definitely love this set, and um, I advise people to get it. Uh, so hit like, please comment if you have any um, opinions, and uh, subscribe, because I will be reviewing the next couple of LEGO uh, superhero sets um, either later today or um, tomorrow and you know, the next couple of days. So, subscribe and bye.